road to the final four began for baseball teams across the Lone Star State on Thursday. There's multiple El Paso squads that have a real shot at making an extended playoff run. They were looking to get it popping in the by district playoffs around West Texas this afternoon. We'll start in class 6A number 18. Americas open a three game by district series at Midland Legacy today. Santana Hernandez with the strikeout to end the first inning. It was scoreless for both sides there and great defense by the Trailblazers throughout Division one prospect. Easton Mumau the diving stop at third. The throw to first for the out. Americas takes game one eight to five. They'll try to clinch the series Saturday in El Paso. We'll stay in the P base Pebble Hills battling Odessa in game one of their by district series. Top six the Spartans in front and adding to it Sal Roca the dribbler through the infield. Evan Lopez scores to make it six to one Pebble Hills in bottom seven Sacramento State signee Dylan Torres ends the game with the strikeout. Pebble Hills wins it seven to one. They can clinch the series on Saturday at home over at Socorro High Eastlake and Midland High facing off in game one of the by district round bottom of the third Aaron Alba does it all for the Falcons. He can pitch and he can hit a solo shot over the wall in left center to give the Falcons a three to nothing lead later on though Midlands John Langhenning will take Alba deep and gone over the right field fence to get the Bulldogs on the board. Midland would go on to beat East Lake nine to four game two of that series Saturday at Midland High. Let's go to the lower valley now. Del Valle and Chapin went head to head in game one of their class 5A by district series. Top seven game tied at four. Chapin's Nicholas Luna powering it to right. A two RBI double gives the Huskies a six to four lead. They had to win on the last day of the season to get into the playoffs. How about this? So Del Valle in the bottom of the seventh. Felipe Rodriguez going to right field. Oh, walk me home, Felipe. RJ Bracamonte scores to win it as Del Valle walks it off. Seven to six. Game two is tomorrow, 6 p.m. at Shapin. In class four, a by district action. Bowie going on the road to beat Fabens four to three tonight. Games two and three of that series Friday at Bowie High School. There's eight Borderland softball teams alive in the area playoffs as well. One playing tonight as Fabens fell to Canyon in game one of their class four a series 15 to nothing. Everybody else in the softball side of things gets underway tomorrow.